Hello painting peeps and welcome it's Kathleen from Cause Creations. Welcome to the No Bra Zone guys. I am glad that you are here. We have some special guests in the house today. Sweet Tara Lombardi. Oh my goodness. Pieces of Tara artistry. If you have not checked her out, you need to. She's sweet, she's kind, she's talented, and she loves her daddy. <laughs> and her daddy has a fantastic YouTube channel as well. Um, DJ's Fluid Art. I'm going to post the link to both of their channels down below. I'm going to be showing you throughout this video some of their wonderful magical art. And uh, I'm also going to introduce you to them. They did a little clip for me to add to this video. But uh, Tara and I have been talking for months. Um, I reached out to her many, many months ago. But uh, life is busy, guys, and sometimes... Uh, we have other things to do. So we finally got together to do this little bit of a collaboration, but it's mainly to introduce my painting peeps to both Tara and her dad, DJ, because they are wonderful, good teachers, fantastic artists, and I am very happy to do just that. One of the things that they both do is they use frog tape to tape off sections of their canvas, which is what I've done here. What I did was last night, I kind of brush painted on some of the colors that Tara and her dad picked for me to do. I let it dry and then I covered up certain parts of the canvas with the frog tape. They, frog tape is wonderful. When I tape the back of my canvases, I use this. Tara recommended that I put down a couple of layers, which I did. And then Tara picked our colors, but we each got to decide on what technique uh, we wanted to do. The colors Tara picked were black or Payne's gray, white, turquoise, by blue, turquoise blue by Amsterdam, turquoise green by Amsterdam, golden moss by Art Alchemy, and gold um, by golden um, paints. I'm sorry guys, I haven't had my second cup of coffee. Now I had all the paints with the exception of the turquoise blue. So what I did was I substituted the artist sloth turquoise deep. So what we have here in this cup right here is Amsterdam turquoise green, which is a lovely, lovely color. Right here we have the Art Alchemy and that is the moss green or the golden moss. These bottles are so hard to read. The writing is so very, very small. Right here is my substitution, and that is Artislav Turquoise Deep. Right here is our Golden Gold. I'm using the Iridescent Gold Fine. Cute little bottle that Golden sent me with a really cool t-shirt. Right here is a combination of both black and the Payne's Gray, so it's a really, really, really deep blue. And right here is my white, which is Amsterdam Titanium White. All my paints are mixed with one-third Liquitex Pouring Medium, one-third GAC 800, one-third Floetrol. And um, they're mixed to a relatively thin consistency. They leave a little bit of a trace when the paint hits the paint in the cup below. So... Once again, you guys got to go go check out DJ's art and Sweet Tara Lombardi from Pieces of Tara and uh, tell them I said hello. I promise you won't be disappointed. Oh, what am I doing? I'm going to do a dry swipe. I'm going to try something a little bit different. My um, colors that I painted last night are totally dry. 
I'm going to lightly mist my canvas with water and I'm going to use some damp paper towels to swipe my colors across the canvas and then uh, a few hours later we'll come back and we'll pull the tape off and we'll see how we did guys. I'm glad you're here. Let's get busy. Hi everyone, my name is Dave. I'm with DJ Fluid Arts, and this is my daughter, Tara. Hello, and she's Ellen. with Pieces of Tara Artistry. So, um, Kathleen Osmore reached out to us recently, and she so graciously asked us to do a collaboration with her. So, we're really excited about that. Um, but she also asked us to kind of give a little introduction of ourselves. So, Deb, maybe you can tell us um, how did you get introduced to the uh, fluid art world? Okay. Well, a few years ago, I retired, and I was looking for a hobby, and I've always wanted to paint. Uh, so I started looking at some of the YouTube artists, John Beckley specifically, because I was interested in abstract art. And uh, so after looking at some other artists, I started to notice some of the fluid artists, like Kathleen Osmore, uh, Ren Skidowna, and uh, I really got interested in it. And so uh, my daughter came over one day, and and we started playing around with a few things and well, I'll let her tell you the rest. So yeah, I was introduced actually through my dad. Um, when he told me that he had started painting, I basically almost fell on the floor because I had no idea that he had any interest in it at all. So um, he started showing me though, after he showed me his art, of course, um, he started showing me videos of um, John Beckley and um, like he said, uh, Kathleen Osmore, Rinska Donna, people who had really kind of inspired him. And so he asked if I wanted to try it out because he had all the paints and in, in the, the supplies. So I said, sure, uh, why not? And so um, I had been my whole life. I've been kind of interested in like crafty things. And I was a jewelry artist for probably about 10 years. So um, I've always been kind of interested in the arts. Never, I've never painted. I've never, you know, had any type of artistic training at all. Um, but it, it intrigued me. So uh, we went to his his uh, makeshift office studio, and uh, from that day forward, I was hooked. I love it. I love doing it. Um, so as soon as I I started, I uh, I came home and I cleaned out my basement and I made a really rustic studio and since then I haven't looked back and so this has been actually a really fun journey. We talk about it all the time. Probably people around us are annoyed with us a lot <laughs> but um, but yeah we love it and so we're so appreciative. Thank you so much Kathleen for this opportunity and um, so yeah I hope you guys enjoy the paintings. I just want to say one other thing. You know uh, we, we talk all the time and we ask ourselves why are we doing this you know why are we painting and getting on YouTube uh, we don't get rich doing it and that's for sure you know, most of you that do fluid arts and are uh, on YouTube you know that we don't make a lot of money doing this uh, we do it for one reason and that reason is because we love to do uh, fluid art we love to paint and uh, with Tara and I we get an opportunity uh, that we can share this together. Now, we don't live close to one another, so uh, this is a way for us to continue to connect. And so uh, she inspires me. I can't. He's <laughs> a softie. He inspires me too. <laughs> so, anyway, Kathleen, we really appreciate this opportunity. Yes, thank you. Spending the days on my own Then repeats this For weeks to come I don't care what I miss Cause my life is dismissed I keep searching 